Hi everybody and welcome back. Wanted to show you my cyclic tank. This is one big uh, 240 gallon, uh, seven feet long by 24 wide. Uh, big massive tank. It's full of all kinds of cichlids. Um, two silver dollars and a group of uh, five or six tinfoil barks that you can see there. So there are some African cichlids, Central and South American cichlids uh, in here. It's a big group. A lot of fish. Got some viejas, the big dolphin. Always think the dolphin is the boss, but then these two guys are kind of ruling everything. Uh, that blood parrot and my massive blue Texas cichlid. By far the biggest cichlid in this thing. I want to meet by far, he's way bigger, way chunkier. So I got a group of beautiful, beautiful fish in here. They're very colorful. It doesn't matter how I put the decoration down there, they're always going to move them. There are lots of plecos. Uh, there is a crayfish from the Asian store that we added here a couple months ago. I thought he will be gone by now, but no, he's still there. It's kind of hard to find him, but he's there. Red Devil over here. Vieja. Some really cool fish. I hope you guys enjoy this. I uh, got plenty of filtration. Uh, I added this the other day. Uh, I was fixing uh, two of the canister filters in the back, and it was gonna take me a few hours, so I added this to keep the water flow and you know some filtration. And I haven't taken them down, so. So over here I have my sump pushing water down to my thousand gallon and then here I got the other guys. Got a bumblebee up there, got three red devils, got a golden uh, clown knife with extra spots in it, my beautiful Florida guard, regular for the customers. Got my Hybrid. Got my really nice Bashirs in here. My beautiful, beautiful uh, Santosa. I love that guy. He seemed like he got a couple scratch ups on him. Uh, this catfish, sometimes, you know, these three guys I got here, uh, they get pretty jumpy and whoever it's nearby them will jump out too and they get big scratches in them. Uh, they're not bite marks. Uh, you will have chunks missing and that's not the case. Got my big this year. These guys are pretty big. Now oh, here I got my got my guppies. Now for this thing. Probably not gonna be so great for the fish. But I added a tire truck eel. 
Should be somewhere down there. I wonder if you're gonna be eating some of the fried uh, guppies. Pretty sure he will. Some vegetation in here going on too. Uh, these guys are thriving, you know, they're, they're doing just fine in this pocket. Over here. Got my peacock. Peacock number one. Peacock number two back there. Then I got my longfish. And a black hole. Longfish is here, he's healing up. Uh, while he was here, in that corner over there, he was not eating, never saw him eating once. He's been here, he's even eating goldfish. Any feeder fish I put in there, tilapia, and uh, even uh, sticks. So I pellet, sticks, he, he's been eating well, so. Now here, this is the big thousand gallon tank that was leaking. And it was leaking down here. So we dropped the we dropped the water volume drastically. And we added a couple packers. We got four packers in here. We got my snake head over there. We got a snake head goby down there. Yeah, that's right. Here. Some pretty nice fish in here. And now, this is my new addition. This is a. Can't get a good. You know what I mean? It's a pickle class. This guy was selling it. And, uh, got to, to his house and the fish was in a bucket outside in the cold, not doing well. Fish uh, changed colors. And when I got here, it was belly up. Uh, so I thought I had just lost a really, really beautiful fish. He's here. I made this enclosure for him. Uh, he got some algae, uh, some, uh, Thing running going on. I put some medication on him. This whole tank is being medicated for this guy and now him. Uh, so we'll see what happens. I hope he he makes a full turn around and water is pretty warm. So I'm really hoping uh, he makes it a beautiful fish. Now here. You can see right here. Yeah, I got some glue on my finger. I do uh, body work on vehicles and uh, auto glass. So sorry for that. So this guy right here, it's a uh, sun catfish. Beautiful fish. Got one of my big huskers. And my African leaf fish are here. These guys are also medicated. Something happened in this big tank, and this guy got attacked. So we're removing him. He's the oldest of all the Oscars. So I just want to make sure that he makes it. Jalopy is here. All my other Oscars. Let's see. I'm gonna slow down here. You guys can see it better. Got my red tail, shovel nose, everybody's in here. So we're either planning on taking this fully down and giving this away to somebody with, with a good home for them, or maybe the back of the house, we might make a uh, another pond, I don't know. Big stuff need to happen, so. Got my clown mags down there. You see the clown mag? Yep, two of them. Big, massive black, or maybe the biggest black that you've ever seen. Got my tiger shovel nose. Very 
Oh my god, I'm like massive, massive uh, clown knife. Red pill. Looking for my Grammy. I don't see my Grammy here. Let's see if he's hiding or what. Where is that grass? Definitely way too big. He's the second biggest fish in here, so. I got him in that side, that's why I can't see him. Anyway, anyhow, wanted to show you guys a fish today. This is my wife's uh, convict uh, farm. She got all these convicts reproducing all, all the time. The pink one over there. There you go. See that baby? Yeah, they're kind of all over. They're hiding. Oh. And yeah, this is a 60 gallon with a whole bunch of future monsters. Well, I hope you guys like it. This is it. This is the fish room. This is my pumps, uh, my sump setup that everybody talks about. Got fish here, filtration here, bio over here, drops down, got heaters, I got aeration, I got more heaters here, and I got a UV light that right now is uh it's uh it's not working. Well it's, it's in working order. Uh, I just unplugged it. Because I'm medicating everybody, I don't want no chemicals, I don't want that feeling anything, so that's where we at here. Please like and subscribe. This is Eric's Fish Kingdom. This is my obsession. This is why my wife is always mad at me. I know the audio sucks, but if you've made it this far, please make sure you like and subscribe. And uh, we'll be having more fish here to show you. Got a lot of other cool videos, you know, I got fish stores and different stores. But overall, all my fish, look at this, are the nicest one you're gonna find. Look at these guys. These are amazing. Come on, man. Find me a nicer one than that. Find me a nicer guy than this guy. Come on. Look at this. Like and subscribe. FX6 here. And then my inventions over here. Same over there. Same over here. If it works, you don't have to fix it. Alrighty, y'all. Oh, there you go. See the Grammy? Here, right there. Man, I was afraid that he would be gone completely, but yeah, we found him. All right, see ya later.